They say a rose is a symbol of true love. And here's a cheesy little trick that might help you find it. For this project, all you're going to need is a single serviette. Open it flat on a table, then fold one of the edges back about an inch and a half from the top. Now simply flip it over and place one of your thumbs on the corner behind the strip. We're going to roll the whole thing around the outside of our thumb until it forms a tube. And when it looks like this, try pinching it off just below the flap and gently twist until it starts tightening up. This is going to be the flower's head. Let's keep twisting it down another inch or two to form a stem, then take one of the corners at the bottom and fold it up along the side. You should be able to see how this corner is forming a little leaf. As we continue twisting the stem down the rest of the way, it should be starting to resemble a real flower, but the flower head doesn't look very convincing yet. To fix that, let's reach inside and twist the inner folds around, and now it looks incredible. The flap on the outside can be gently pulled up around the rose head to make a little decorative hood, and it's done. You've just made an instant white rose to impress somebody special. Now check this out. If you try spraying a little perfume or cologne on the flower head, it'll smell good too. I gave one of these to the girl of my dreams seven years ago, and now we're married and have three kids. If you don't have a special someone, try using it as a fancy way to tip that cute server that just brought you your food. Well, now you can turn a humble eating accessory into a clever expression of your affection. By the way, you don't even have to have a napkin. I just made this one with a hamburger wrapper. How awesome is that? Well, that's it for now. If you like this project, perhaps you'll like some of my others. Check them out at thekingofrandom.com.